makes the grab. Third and one coming up. Look out, the defense is showing a blitz here. The Chiefs from the 32. Jamal Charles. Tackles made, and that'll move the chains. They're going to the hurry up, back to the line. When you see linebackers moving around like this, that means they're probably going to blitz. It's complete to Jeremy Macklin. The Chiefs have been awesome today on first down. That time, it's a nice play design. They throw the football, it picks up solid yards. Second and short. Boy, that's what every offense likes to be in. Jones able to read that play and make the hit. It's third down now. Right around three minutes remaining in the third. Third down at four. And it's spotted away. It's a good job that time by the defense on third down. Find a way to get off the field. The defender found the way. Knocked that pass down. The Chiefs don't want any part of punting the football. They're going to go for it on fourth down. The D-line saw something on the offense. Everybody shifting to the left. And they'll run the football with Charles. The Chiefs turn the ball over on downs. The Chiefs go for it on fourth down, and they do not get it done. Now it's up to their defense to bail them out. The Packers have done a whale of a job taking their halftime lead and adding a whole lot more to it here in the third quarter. And yeah, they're just doing everything we saw them do in the first half. Just dominating the pace of play and just being more physical than the defense. The Packers snap it at the 41. Howard's the one who made the big stop. They're going to the hurry up offense and they're back to the line quickly. The Packers take it from the 43. Linebackers nowadays are so talented. They can just do everything. Uh, they're strong enough to stop the run. But how about this interception? Good job. Good reading of the quarterback and a nice catch. Smith's back in shotgun formation. He'll throw it over the middle. It's now second down. The Packers lined up in the nickel. Smith takes it from the gun. Avant makes the catch. He'll pick up seven this time. That's his first reception today. On the way, third down. The Packers set at the line. Dime package. Here's the handoff. Charles is tackled down at the 43. The Chiefs will go for it here on fourth down and a short yardage situation. The Chiefs take it from the 43. Travis Kelsey comes down with it. I thought that was a pretty risky play that time by the offense. Even though it's the second half and you're down, you don't always have to go for it on fourth down. Fortunately for them, they got it that time. And they'll give it to Jamal Charles. And he is brought down at the 39. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. The Chiefs have it at the 39. And Matthews is all over the ball carrier. Hurry up. Two-minute offense. The Chiefs will take the snap from the 40. And it's batted down. That was a good call by the defensive coordinator. He called the right defensive play. The defender's in position and knocks down that third down throw. The offense is going to stay on the field now for this fourth and seven. The Packers defense now loading up, expecting pass with a dying defense. The Chiefs turn the ball over on downs. Pepper's just not an outside rusher. Dude. We see it right here. What a job showing that strength. Stays in position, and the run's coming outside, and he stops it for no gain. Amahali brings the quarterback.
quarterback down. You know, outside linebackers, they're everything all in one. They got to be a pass rusher, uh, a pass cover guy, and they got to be able to stop the run. Nice job that time getting the sack. The Packers will take the snap from the 30. Rodgers going to take off with it. It's intercepted. Lambeau Field always synonymous with frozen tundra. This next play coming from the 47-yard line. Shotgun look here for Alex Smith. The final quarter underway now with this snap. Smith's unable to find his target that time. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football, and it leads to another incomplete pass. Second down and 10. Set up screen to Charles. They bring him to the turf. When you're behind in a football game, all you can do on the offensive side is just go out there and thinking about making plays and picking up first downs, good job by the offense. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Clay Matthews makes the tackle. Look out here. They're going to blitz. They're all packing the line of scrimmage. Quick drop back. And incomplete. What a hit that time. Jim, I just want to say this to the quarterback. It's third and goal. If the play's not there, throw it away. Do not force the action. The corners are going to meet the receivers right on the line of scrimmage. Tosses the football. He's brought down. That's going to bring up fourth down. What a job by the defense down on the goal line. They were playing run all the way. It was a run. They got the penetration, and they tackled the runner for a loss. Alex Smith will take it right from the center. The Chiefs turn the ball over on downs. The Chiefs that time go for it on fourth down, and they fail. I did not understand the decision, but you got to make sure your team doesn't get down from that. You got to keep them up. The Packers will try to put a little drive together and not give the football away, Phil, as each team seems to like one on treat it like it all is out. Oh, they pop up the football and touchdown. What a deflating play for the offense. The defense picks up the fumble, takes it not only for a touchdown, but how long? Look at the blocks. That makes the offense lose its confidence. They're going to have a hard time coming back out on the field and making it happen. Montgomery is going to test the coverage this time. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. The Packers offense now will try to sustain a drive after giving the ball away just a few minutes ago before their defense came up with a play to return the big skin. And they should thank the defense bailing them out of trouble getting that turnover. You're right, they're just giving the football away, not being conscious of holding it the right way. It's just been sloppy play on the offense. No time to waste. They hurry to the line. Second down and seven. The give. Tyvon Branch in on that last play. The Packers really got it going now. They got confidence. They got momentum. They got a small lead here in the second half. And that first down, what does it do? It just gives the offense a coordinator confidence. And, of course, this quarterback, he is always ready to go. The Packers have it at the 39. Howard's all over that offense and brings him down. The Packers lead right now, but you will see that not everything is going their way. Starks had a tough one, especially down the stretch. If they want to control the game, you have to think they're going to go back to him for some more touches and try to get it right. That's right. Keep giving him the football. Keep mixing the plays up. Don't get obvious in your play calls. If you do, the defense will have everything on their side. The catch is made by James Starks. Johnson in on the stop. And now they're in the hurry up. Third and eight. Here's the gift to James Starks. He's going to be tackled right around the 49. 
The defense needs a big stop here in order to give the offense a chance as we're running low on time in this one. Time enough to squeeze in one more play before the two-minute warning here in the fourth. Has his man. Two minutes. Two minutes remaining in the game. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. First and ten. Toss play to Lacey. Breaks the plane, and he's got the touchdown. Man, the defense has to be down at something like this. They allow the offense to score that touchdown in the red zone. My gosh, you only have such a small part of the field to defend, and they just didn't get the job done that time. The Packers for the extra point. The point after is good. The Chiefs are anxious to return the kickoff. is running this one out and he's met head on right there at the 20 the Chiefs taking the field again on offense they paid the price for an aggressive decision on their last possession passing up on the field goal attempt and going for it on fourth down then coming up short yeah look no second guessing for me on that I'll just say this I'll give the defense a lot of credit they were there they were ready for the situation they made the play and that's why the offense came away with no points how do you think the offense is feeling right now after that coach's decision? Well, shoot, they're disappointed. The coach believed in them. You know, they know the coach is showing faith. Well, he showed faith, and they, they let him down. Huge third and long coming up, and they're certainly in four-down territory as well. You know, you go to the hurry-up offense so you can get a high number of plays in, but also you don't want to use the timeout. The grab is made by Kelsey. Kelsey's tackled down at the 43. Now on first down, every snap crucial the rest of the way. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Smith's going to take it from the gun. Launches it down the field. The defender able to knock it away. Got to give the secondary credit this passing league now, it's hard to make plays, but a good play there and another incomplete pass. The Chiefs take it from the 43. Nothing there on the screen. Pass falls incomplete. Third long situations. A lot of coordinators in this league would want to draw play on third long. Why? Because they're just looking for field position, pick up a few yards, and then by some miracle, the running back is able to make guys miss, break some tackles, and pick up a first down. Man, that's just great. Back at the line. They're going for it on fourth. Two hands. Ball was out. A recovery by the defense. Phil, can you believe how untimely a fumble we just saw? I, you know, Jim, I cannot believe it. Here's why. Because you know in a situation like this, the first thought in your mind is you can't fumble the ball, and they did anyway. He's going to be sacked here second time today. He's been brought down behind the line of scrimmage. They'll go to the hurry up here as the clock runs. The Packers have it at the 39. Aaron Rodgers out to James Jones. They come to the line of scrimmage first down. Holding on to the timeout. They'll rush back to the line. Secures it with two hands. Rodgers tackled down at the 30.